topic today is psychology of selling. And we're going to take you through what it takes to actually sell. All right? You agree with me that selling is not logic. People don't buy from you. How do you see yourself? How do you see yourself? Selling is a mind game. Selling is purely a mind game. Now your self-concept has to do with the bundle of beliefs which you carry. It could be financial, it could be social, it could be uh, health-wise, it could be in any area. It has to do with the beliefs that you have of yourself or your environment. Self-concept. You can decide to see yourself as a tiger. Look at the image um, on the slide. The kitten that sees itself as a tiger, or the tiger that sees itself as a kitten. The things you think of most comes to play in your life. Mm, you know what? You are a human being, but you are more than just a human being. You are an energy. Mm, true. Hey! You are an energy. That's why you speak when you talk to me. That's what. So by 1st of December, it's going to appreciate by 100%. You see? So you now project. So you now talk to this client and say, if this property has appreciated in the, next four, in, the, in the last four months by 100%, then it means that in the next four months, in the next 12 months, it will have appreciated by 200%. Why? Because it is close to Alaro City. Why Alaro City? Because Alaro City is in the free trade zone. Why free trade zone? Because free trade zone is to challenge those thoughts that holds you back. Those reg your regular thoughts. Ask yourself, who put it there? Who said so? Why? Who said you can make, you can get one deal and then you just get five end condition? Who said so? Said so? Who said so? I'm in the streets, I know this is. 